So hello from Spain and uh, this is Clyde. Say hello Clyde. Uh, not sure how long you'll stay here but Clyde's a new addition. So we're here in Spain, that's us entering our 22nd day of lockdown. Uh, so week four, I guess, yeah. And you guys are just entering into the second week. So I kind of thought it might be a good idea to sort of share some of our experiences and some of the things that we've done over the last three weeks just to help us cope a little bit. So week one was kind of a bit of a breeze, to be honest. Uh, then week two, the restrictions got tighter and uh, it started getting forced a lot more. So we quickly realised that, you know, we had to find some sort of routine in our, in our day. So we kind of set aside a half an hour, an hour, three times a day just to do things that, you know, we probably never had the time to do. So it could just be anything, really simple things. So for me, it was uh, try to learn Spanish. I've been hopeless at it for the last five years, so try and learn Spanish. Try to learn to cook a bit better. Uh, listen to some audiobooks. You know, just, just really simple things that you would never have the time to do. And, uh, and, yeah, and I guess the most important thing was exercise. You know, this really, really helps. You know, just gentle exercise, even stretching, something you can do easily. In your, in your front room or if you're lucky enough to have a garden. So yeah, it's, I guess other things was we, uh, we, we kind of looked at the weekends and tried to make the weekend special, you know, just something to look forward to. So that could be like cooking your favourite dinner, getting dressed up, you know, just something different, watching a movie. It's just important that you had something to look forward to at the end of the week. So yeah, I guess it's, uh, yeah, it's hard times, but one thing about our sport is, I think we focus too much on the winning and the losing, and we sort of lose sight that just how special and how precious our sport is. We are one large community, we are one large family, and we'll, we'll get through this. So yeah, please just uh, stay well, and please, please uh, stay in. Adios.